Hello guys, hope you're all doing well. Today I'm going to be showing the best guns you can use in the new Leviathan Ryzen update in the new shutdown game mode. A lot of these weapons are close range as most of the gunfights in this game mode are at a shorter distance than you would usually be fighting at. If you enjoy the video, don't forget to like and subscribe. Now let's get into it. The first weapon I've gone for is a 12M auto shotgun, which if you've, if you've been watching my videos you'd know that I'm a big fan of. The thing is absolutely nuts and is way too good at distances a shotgun should not be good at. This gun is very well suited for the shutdown game mode and can take out several players in one mag. You also don't have to spam the shoot button like with other shotguns, with this you simply hold the button and it does the job for you. It's great when you pull off a flank and also great for defending tight close combat areas where it really starts to excel. You will be able to kill people at medium ranges too which is what makes this shotgun so powerful in Battlefield 2042. For those interested, the loadout is the shortened barrel, LS1 laser sight and the buckshot drum mag. The next weapon is the AK-24, probably my all time favourite weapon on Battlefield 2042 and for good reasons too. Great damage output, especially if you manage to get that headshot multiplier which is arguably a little bit too good on assault rifles. It also has easy to control recoil and is reliable at all distances. On the shutdown game mode it can feel a little sluggish at closer range due to the drum mag, meaning you may not be able to be as aggressive as you would with a normal mag. It depends if you want to have more rounds or the movement to be a little bit more slick. The AK-24 is probably the only competitor to the RM-68 at the moment, especially at medium to long range. And with a lot of people using the RM-68, this is a good alternative if you haven't unlocked it yet. I use the Champion Muzzle Break, the Drum Mag and the BCG Light Grip, however the STNR laser sight is also great for this weapon. After the AK-24, we have the PP-29 SMG. All around a great SMG and is very effective in this game mode. It has great hip fire accuracy and allows you to get up close and personal which suits players of an aggressive playstyle. It's also not too bad at medium range due to its low recoil making it easy to hit your shots and be more accurate. The PP29 also comes with a 60 round mag making it a great weapon for taking down several enemies with one mag and not having to worry about ammo management. The setup I use is the champion muzzle break and the standard issue mag along with a reticle of your choice. The AM40 is somewhat of a hybrid between an SMG and an assault rifle and is a great choice for shutdown game mode. It's great at medium and short range and also benefits from the assault rifle headshot multiplier. Very high rate of fire and the hip fire accuracy isn't terrible when using one of the laser sight attachments. It does come with a 40 round drum mag, however it burns through ammo very quickly and the reload can be quite lengthy, meaning you have to pull yourself out of the action into safety to reload and not leaving yourself exposed. Although it has a high rate of fire, the recoil is not bad at all and can be controlled at medium range. This gun does suffer at long range and if you can, I would try to use it in that short to medium range where it's really effective. The loadout I recommend is the Champion Muzzle Break, MGL Laser Sight and Standard Issue Drum Mug. Finally, we have the RM68, still broken and still not been nerfed. It's time is coming. All around, great weapon, at all ranges, can down people with 3 shots if you manage to get a headshot. Great at short range if you equip the shortened barrel, but even without it, it still shreds in close combat. Low recoil, easy to control, and is great for sitting back and defending the objective when you or the team have planted, planted the lance. The only real negative I could think of for this weapon is the hip fire accuracy. Even with the laser sights, it's not the best, but it doesn't really matter because it's better than any other weapon on the game, and as I said before, the only real competitors is either the AK-24 or the SFAR. I use the CCN suppressor brake, MGL laser sight, and standard issue extended mags. Really enjoying the new shutdown game mode and think it's the best mid-season event yet. It offers a different experience to what we have had in the game before and it really shows the strengths of specialists and how useful they are when they're used properly. I would definitely like to see this game mode be made into a permanent mode and maybe this can be the foundation for a competitive game mode in the future for the next Battlefield. That is the one thing Battlefield has always lacked. 
The last time we saw DICE attempt a competitive mode was back in Battlefield 1, however nothing ever came from it. But with the most games and players wanting that competitive edge in games nowadays, I think it's something definitely worth exploring. Let me know what you think of the shutdown game mode and what guns you are using to get them wins and grind them ribbons. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next one.